You see a tarp on a roof and you think it's a temporary fix, a quick fix until repairs are made. Yeah, but what for one Greensboro woman, the cost was something she just couldn't take on. So her rooftop tarp it stayed there for years. And her small problems became big issues and then she needed a new roof. She wants to know as Kevin Kennedy learned she hired a man who didn't stick to his word, but a guardian angel stepped in and made it right. Where flowers bloom, so does hope. Maybe that's why Lydia Jones Fawcett spends so much time planting seeds. Surrounded by flowers and vegetables. My vegetables and my herbs are donated. Life's troubles don't seem so terrible out here. I got tomatoes. Lydia tried to escape a daunting financial reality, one that comes with a giant blue tarp on the roof, several leaks under the shingles, and a ceiling that shows it's been overwhelmed by water. When I came home, it was a flood in the back bedroom and water just running down out of the ceiling. The roof hasn't been right for several years, but earlier this year, small leaks became large problems, water pouring through in multiple places. My bed is soaking wet, the floor is soaking wet. What am I doing? I'm here by myself. What can I do? Lydia needing a roofer fast, finding one on Home Advisor. He promised me, Miss Lydia, I do a good job. And uh, I, I liked him. A check for $2,400 written, the job scheduled to start a week later. That morning, he didn't show. He didn't call, so I called him and he went out his phone. That would be the last time Lydia saw him. The money gone, not enough to hire someone else, so the tarp remains. Six months like this, and water often gets through. I feel like uh, I've been hated. Lydia reaching out to our Call for Action volunteers, a call to the roofer maid who promised to refund the money, but never did. So we went looking for him, finding him at this trailer park. It was never meant for any kind of malicious or anything like that. Uh, but, I, you know, I'll make it right. I, 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 that's the main of my word. I, I'll make something happen. Well, that was three months ago. Angelo Landry has yet to make it right. But Lydia never lost hope everything would work out. Audrey Hepburn said to plant a garden is to believe in tomorrow. Lydia kept believing, and something amazing came of it. One of the guys said that, uh, he wanted to bless me. A man Lydia had never met heard her story and decided to pay for a new roof. I just didn't know what to say. I told him I, I just, you know, that was unbelievable. Almost nine months after this man took off with her money, Lydia found an angel. Looking to the heavens includes a view of her new roof. I believe God is looking down on me. He's touching hearts, uh, blessing me. Friends are the flowers in a garden of life. Lydia's garden is full, but there's always room for a new flower. Kevin Kennedy, Two Wants to Know.